made it through another brutal chest workout. And I never failed to keep my trusty shaker cup filled with protein close within reach. After all, I want to kickstart that muscle building process as soon as the last set's over. And there's nothing better for that than the right kind of protein. You want to know what kind of protein I have in my cup? If you said whey protein, you're one third correct. What does that mean, one third? That means I have three proteins that I never fail to put in my post-workout protein shake. Yes, the first one is whey. Why whey? Well, as you probably know, whey is the fastest digesting protein you can get your hands on. And that's critical after workouts because you want to get those aminos to your muscles ASAP so that that muscle building process can get started. Research has shown the whey is very effective for kickstarting muscle protein synthesis. Research also shows that casein protein, which is the other milk protein, can also enhance muscle growth after workouts. Now casein protein is slow digesting, unlike whey, which is fast digesting. We used to think that that meant casein was a poor choice to take after workouts. It was too slow to get to the muscle to cause any real muscle growth. However, research shows that when subjects drink a protein shake that has whey plus casein protein in it, they gain more muscle mass than those who are drinking the whey shake without the added casein. So, be sure you add casein to your whey shake after workouts. What's the third protein? It's soy protein. Sounds like something for your girlfriend? Wrong. Soy protein is a critical protein to have after workouts. And there's numerous reasons why. The most recent study found that soy protein actually boosts growth hormone levels. The other reason you want to add soy to your protein shake is that soy has been found to enhance muscle recovery after workouts. So, you can't go wrong with the whey, casein, soy trio. I typically add 20 grams of whey, 10 grams of casein, and 10 grams of soy. It's the best way to take advantage of muscle recovery and muscle growth. We'll